Let's talk about the chromosome structure. Chromosomes are present inside the nuclei of the cell. In order to understand the production of chromosome, we first need to understand the cell division cycle. The cell, in order to divide into two daughter cells, undergoes this process called a cell division or cell cycle. It is a four-stage process consisting of S phase, G1 phase, G2 phase, and a mitosis phase. The S phase is also called as a replication phase. During this phase, every chromosome is copied once and the copy is joined to the original at the center, making an X-shaped structure. The original chromosome and the copy are now called as sister chromatids whereas the center of their attachment is called a centromere. Based on position of centromere, there are four types of chromosomes. Telocentric, acrocentric, submetacentric, and metacentric. As humans, we have 23 pairs of chromosomes, out of which 22 pairs are body chromosomes, also called as autosomes whereas one pair is of the sex chromosome, which is also called as allosomes. These 23 pairs of chromosomes means that there are 46 individual chromosomes per cell. Now let's see how did we get these number of chromosomes. During fusion of gametes, the father and mother both provide equal number of chromosomes 23 each in their sperm and ova respectively. Therefore, the baby has a total of 46 chromosomes. The gametes, since they have half the number of chromosomes, are called as haploid cells, while the baby has diploid number of cells. This video took a lot of hard work so please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel.